hello friends so this time we'll be making an entire player using XO player entire player in the sense we'll be having next button previous button uh, the usual play and pause the settings button for changing the quality we'll be having a video title displayed on the top and we'll be having a back button we'll be having or we'll be also having the lock button uh, to lock the screen while user is watching the video we'll also be having a chrome cost button and uh, we'll also be having this subtitles captioning button caption on or off button so before we proceed this is the first part of this video tutorial uh, the in the first part we'll be only looking at the layout of the project so let's get on to it uh, actually I have uh, like previous times I have written the entire code and I'll be just showing you the code and explaining you so right now I have uh, made the entire design invisible step by step I'll be making it visible so uh, we can understand it better so we need the surface view inside the aspect ratio frame layout so here it is and we'll be making it right now I'm uh, this is vi visibly gone and I'll be making it making it visible for now so as you can see this covers the entire portion of the screen so this will be at the back the video will be played on this surface view and the controls will be upon this surface view so we have this linear layout next let's make it visible it is already visible this is the parent uh, linear layout so I've given the ID as root okay so let's make the child linear layout which is not visible make it visible so this is the topmost bar we have the back button we have the video title we have the chromecast button so inside it you can see the image button for back button text view for video title and the image button for chromecast these are the icons and then we have another linear layout which I have given ID as middle make it visible so as you can see the top bar takes a portion the middle bar takes the entire portion so let's get to the third layout now you can see the middle layout is taking the remaining portion of the top bar and the bottom bar between area is taken by the middle layout let's say if there was no middle uh, mi uh, if there was no middle green uh, linear layout let's make it go on for right now see as you can see there the both top and bottom are sticking to each other we don't want like that we want the seek bar to be uh, we want the seek bar at the bottom so we need the middle layout so that's for uh, the and, and that is the importance of middle linear layout now coming to the third which is uh, seek bar which is at the bottom it is also a linear layout it has the f text view seek bar and another text view first the current duration current time elapsed the seek bar and the total duration of the video okay and at the end we have a controls linear layout I have given this ID as controls I'll make it visible so in this controls panel we have lock button previous button to make uh, to load the previous video 
next button to load the next video this this buttons are like you can reverse the video for 30 seconds you can forward the video of uh, to 30 seconds usual play and pause subtitles button okay. subtitles means captioning on or off and then we have the settings button to show the qualities of that video if the if the video has the qualities it will show and the lock button so this is in uh, this image is image button is lock button then we have another linear layout inside this main li linear layout for for designing purposes previous button reverse button reverse 30 seconds button play and pause okay the forward 30 seconds button next button the linear layouts and so here and then we have another image button for captioning button and at the end we have this settings button to show the quality of the video and these are the visible controls to the user and when the video is in the buffering mode we will be showing a progress bar in the middle of the screen this is the progress bar let's make it gone for right now and so this is the swipe functionality when user swipes from top to bottom or up bottom to top uh, volume will increase or decrease same is the case for brightness control also when user swipes from top to bottom bottom to top the swipeness uh, the brightness will increase or decrease we'll make it gone for right now so this is the lock button after the user has locked the uh, you used the lock button this is the unlock button actually when user clicks on the lock button only this button will be shown to the user R rest all the controls will be hidden so let's make it hide go on for right now so this is the volume current volume when user swipes this will be shown in the center uh, the current volume while the user is swiping I have written the text 22 it is actually while swiping the text will be coming dynamically the 22 te text same for brightness also as you can see brightness also uh, there is the same case and there is an extra feature while user is swiping from left to right the video will be forwarded and while user is swiping from right to left the video will be reversed and the depending on the acceleration of the swipe the video will forward like 10 seconds or 20 seconds so this plus 00, zero colon 10 seconds is plus 10 seconds forward and 0, zero 44 seconds is the time user has swiped so it, uh, if user is swiping from right to left it will be minus zero colon zero zero the dynamic limit so make it gone for right now so this is it this was the entire layout of the player in the next video we will be looking at the code of the video or the icon set of the video stay in touch subscribe this channel uh, if you like the videos and also 
do comment do share this videos bye thanks for watching okay guys so let's test on the device so as you can see all the design which we have implemented is right there the black portion in the behind is a surface view where the video will play and rest all is all the other controls yet we have to write the code for these controls so subscribe to this channel to watch the further further videos in this series we'll be implementing everything in this player